My eyebrows are an even. Does it look even now? <sighs> Whatever. Hey guys, I look super duper scary right now, but you know, we're fixing it, we're fixing it. So some exciting news, we're leaving for Alani in like a week and I'm not prepared at all. I need to do a lot of things, run a little bit of errands before I go. So today I'm gonna take you with me to my Pilates class because yes, we are working on ourselves. I have been doing Pilates since October of 2022. It's now the end of April 2023 and guys, Pilates is really beating me up. Like Pilates, it's really shaping me. It's amazing, I love it. The only downfall is its price. It's super expensive. But you know what? I see it more as an investment I'm going to Alani specifically for my mom's graduation. I went there last year just for a vacation, but my mom is graduating with her doctorates and because she's a DVC member, she has a timeshare and everything, she gets points off and I don't really know how the whole point system works. So we're staying in Alani because my mom is also a huge Disney fan. Just like moi, like mother, like daughter. I have to do my nails, I have to go shopping for a dress, a graduation dress. My mom is doing like this whole thing, you know, whole graduation dinner at Alani, which I'm so, so excited to film. I'm so excited to meet all the characters. I'm really entering in like my Moana era, my Lilo and Stitch era. So I'm gonna finish doing my makeup here. I'm gonna get ready for Pilates. I have to run to Target. I have to run to the mall real quick just to get my dress. It's this super cute dress from American Eagle. It like really snatches your waist and guys, Come on, I gotta have it. I gotta have it. It's absolutely adorable. I need it. Give it to me now. <gasps> Wait, guys, no. Look, I hope you can see this. Is that not the perfect dress for Hawaii? No. Oh. <sighs> you know what, it says that it's in store. After my Pilates class, I'm gonna go in and decide if I want the white one or the floral one. I feel like I might get both. So this is the fit, and if you think that I get ready, like I get all my makeup ready before I go to Pilates, I don't. I normally don't. The only time I have my makeup ready is after work, and then I go to Pilates, but because I'm going to the mall today and I'm running errands all day, and I'm not really gonna stop by at home. I gotta, I gotta put some makeup on. On top of this, I'm gonna wear my Lululemon jacket. And I love this jacket. It really just snatches me up. With this jacket, I feel like one of those like speed walking moms in the neighborhood. a really good difficult class but I'm really happy I went because you know hot girl summer plus I have a boyfriend so not really hot girl summer but hot girl summer in a way where it's like self-care waking up early going to the beach with your friends being healthy going to Disneyland that kind of hot girl summer that's the kind of summer that I want to manifest that's the kind of summer that I want I'm gonna head to Starbucks because I always like to treat myself after a little a little Pilates sesh. I don't really know what I want. I'm feeling a matcha. Matcha vibes really sound pretty good right now. The Starbucks that I go to always has these cute questions. So today, hi. Um, can I have two iced matcha lattes, tall, please? Um, one with almond milk and one with oat. Um, yes, I'll have an egg white bite, please. I think the bell pepper ones. Do you have that? Thank you so much. I'm nervous to ask them about the joke. <laughs> What's the joke? I don't even remember the joke. My anxiety is kind of getting to me. What if they're like... Um, no, thank you. This one is mine. Thank you so much. And what was the what was the answer to the joke? 
Pork chop, okay. Thank you so much, bye. Pork chop, what, what do you call a pig that does karate? Pork chop. <laughs> That's so cute. First of all, is it just me? Or did these get smaller? I ordered a tall. So I, I know a tall's pretty small. But why is it literally like miniature? Justin and his mom are having a little mother mother son time, which I think is so adorable. Let's go give him his Starbies and let's go shopping together. There's your Starbies. Isn't it smaller? Don't you think it looks tinier? The oh, tall? Yeah. It's so cute. It's not cute. It's criminal. Alrighty, I'm at the mall. Hung out with Justin for just a little bit. Now time to find that dress. Here's my whole little setup. These shorts. I found this top that I think would look super cute with those shorts and the dresses. It's so loose up here. I need to like, I need to tie this, but I don't want to. It's really short. You see how short that is? Oh my god. Also, I just don't like how the fit makes me look like I'm pregnant. The girl on TikTok looks so good in it. And I was like, she looks amazing. Me? I'm not feeling it. Let me look at myself in the bigger mirror outside. I think I just sit here. What's up with the lighting in that fitting rooms? What's up with that? That makes you not want to buy it. Like, I look, I'm scary right now. I love like the opening right here. Very flowy, very fun. But wouldn't this outfit look absolutely golden and alarming? I'm obsessed. I love it. I love it. So I ended up not getting any dresses. I did get two pairs of shorts and that top. It was buy and go with 50, so I was like, why not? I'm just gonna go get another pair of shorts. Now I'm gonna stop by Brandy, see if they have a dress. But you know, I decided not to get the dress because I just wasn't really digging it. I just wasn't by them, you know? So mm, let's go see what else the mall has to offer. small slash small and so am I but she tried on a medium and she looked good so I was like maybe I need to try on the medium I have the medium on I'm gonna take a picture outside but this is how it looks what do we think of it guys when should I have this Okay, I'm getting this dress. And the amazing thing about this is that I, I'm flat chested, so it's not, there's not a lot of boobage going on. I'm gonna get it. I love it. Okay, so I'm back in my car and I ended up buying that dress and then I went to free people and I looked around. So I'm gonna run a couple of errands and then I'm gonna head home and depending on the time of the day, there's still light out, then I'll give you a haul. If not, then this is like a week long thing. So we'll review all our outfits another day. <laughs> So we're stopping by Disneyland real quick just to film some transitions before Alani and also it's the last day of food and wine and also the last day of Soren over California and I have missed Soren over California and I have not been on it since it's been back 
so we need to go on that and i also have one more tab left on my food and wine pass i also have to drop off some packages for my recent giveaway you guys know who you are if you're watching i'm so excited for you guys to wear those hats i'm so thrilled yeah so i'm gonna drop off those packages and then we're gonna head to Disneyland. <laughs> I've never been in the elevator before and they have like all of the buttons right here so you know where to go. I'm walking into DCA right now. I'm here specifically to get the Elote ice cream because it is the last day and I really want to try it even though I've heard really bad things from it. I also want to go to the store and make some transitions. So let's go. This looks very interesting. So I made a couple of TikToks. I got a strawberry horchata. One, because I've never tried it before, and two, it matches my hat. Not exactly, of course, but I'm wearing a strawberry hat, and this is a strawberry horchata. I thought it fit pretty well. Now I'm just taking some pictures, and then I might ride a ride, and then I'm gonna go home. I just checked Soren for the wait for that, and it's a 65 minute wait. Kinda not down to wait 65 minutes. I feel like it's even worse just because who am I gonna talk to? I have really nothing to do in line. I feel like it would be worth waiting 65 minutes if I was with someone. So we're gonna ride a credit coaster because I have a single right there. Oh yeah. I'm also getting really comfortable with this whole solo park trip, but this is my third solo day, guys. This is my third time solo here. I'm vlogging in public. I'm talking like while I'm walking and stuff. I'm getting the hang of it, guys. This is pretty nice. Heading back to the car right now. That was a super fun day. I just went for a couple of hours just to try the Lotte Paleta. I'm so sorry if I'm saying that wrong. I took French in high school. I filmed some transition videos, so I'll finish them when I'm in a lobby. I'm so excited. I went on a credit coaster. I didn't really film that. I kind of just wanted to enjoy my time. The single rider line was so much longer than the actual regular line, which was weird. But now I'm gonna go home, pack, do my nails, do what all I need to do to get ready for money. <laughs> guys it's saturday i'm leaving saturday sunday monday tuesday i am leaving in three days i am leaving to alani in three days i could not be more excited especially now that i get to show you what i'm wearing this is the fun part guys this is the this is the, this is the moment that i've been waiting for for you guys to see the dress the one that I went back for, it's right here, it's hanging. So of course, I have to try on this dress that I got from American Eagle first. So let's try it on. I'm gonna do a Hannah Montana transition. Okay, but picture it with the, oh, uh, whoa, whoa. You know, the Hannah Montana transition, something, whatever, scratch that. This is her. This is Miss Girl in all her glory. Absolutely adore this dress. And I think it's especially appropriate for a graduation celebratory party in Hawaii. So I'm thinking what I could pair this dress with would be these stunning kitten heels. Hold on, give me a moment. Ain't that gorgeous. And I also have a flower claw clip that I think if I put at the back of my hair, like. It ain't perfect, it ain't perfect, but look. This is gonna be outfit number one for my mom's graduation dinner and party celebration. It's giving, guys. And I think I'm gonna do my hair wavy. I do have like a wavy crimper curler thing. So I think this is choice number one. My mom's graduation dinner. I love it. Look how flowy it is. Oh, this is another outfit that I plan on wearing. A more casual, I'm walking around the beach kind of outfit. Nothing too pizzazzy. I did add the seashell accessory just to give it a little more um, and a claw clip. This is definitely something that I would be wearing, say, 
I just got done with the pool, had a shower, and now I'm just gonna walk around the resort a little bit, giving that kind of vibe. Okay, this is another outfit that I'm super excited to wear because I made this like straw Mickey bucket hat and just look, look. You're joking. I made this one a little lopsided. It has to be higher up, but you get it. I made this bucket hat specifically for Amani. I'm a bit crazy. And I think that this outfit is super cute or anything like I'm chilling by the beach. I'm chilling by the beach. Yeah, this is like a chilling by the beach kind of outfit. I can wear this hat literally if I'm swimming because it's not water resistant, but you know, it dries up really quick. So this is a fun little hat, fun little Disney Alani themed bucket hat that I can wear at the beach and it won't get ruined. I love it, I love it so much. This outfit is giving, it's giving. Let me know what you guys think about this hat. I think it's absolutely adorable. Like I said, I'm working on my Disney license. This hat might be up in a couple of months. Outfit number three, outfit number three. This outfit honestly reminds me a lot of my mom. When I wear this, I see my mom. My mom loves Hawaii, like she loves the Hawaiian culture, she loves everything. Fun fact, I used to be a hula dancer when I was little because she was so into the Hawaiian culture. She wanted to take on hula dancing, so I just did it too. This outfit besides the shirt, like if this was clothes, this is giving me very much my mom when she was younger. And I thought it would be so adorable to pair it with this flower. All of these accessories besides that bucket hat and that flower clip, those are all my mom's. I have two Mickey ears over there that I'm gonna show in a sec. That's my mom's, because she is obsessed with everything Alani. That's why I'm going again, even though I just went last year. How? Adorable. And I thought I could just pair them with my platform Light. This look is, I'm saying that, I'm saying like every look is giving, but, but this is giving, this is giving. Oh my god, oh guys, guys. This is by far one of my favorite outfits. Honestly, I love every single outfit, like what am I even saying? Okay guys, I gotta be real with you. I'm like really tired from taking off clothes, putting back clothes, taking off clothes, putting clothes back on because I just did this and so I'm just gonna show you the accessories and if you want, you guys can look at my TikTok. I posted all my outfits on there and you can check out my TikTok. It's Sky at Disney and I have all the outfits that I plan to be wearing. But here are the accessories that my mom bought last time we were at Alani. So first are these ears. She hasn't worn them since last year because she hasn't gotten a chance to go to Disney. You can see these, it has the cute little arch right here. Isn't this so adorable? And Minnie and Mickey swimming in like fruit. What? I love I love the little flower details right here. And here's another one that she hasn't worn yet. I feel like they, they've sold this at the parks, but she bought it at Alani. This is a right there. Again, with a little flowery detail and the sparklies. Let me just try them on for you guys. The ears are super adorable. Look how cute those are. That's some of the outfits that I'm gonna be wearing. I just don't have the energy anymore. I'm tired, I wanna lay down. And you know what I got? Came the other day. Oh my god, it matches my nail color. I'm gonna change my nails. I don't like this color. It's amazing. And it has a little charging setup and a flashlight, guys. I do have to finish some homework before I leave just so I don't have to stress about it. The last thing I want is for me to stress about a homework assignment. I'm super excited. Who's excited? Who's excited to go to Alani, guys? I'm so excited and so stoked to show you guys all the rooms and stuff. But I do have a friend's birthday party to go to tonight, so we're gonna do that. And then I feel like the next time that you guys see me might be doing my nails. So like the next time you guys see me might be me packing for Hawaii. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Guess what day it is, guys? Guess what day it is? It's May 1st, it's the first of the month. I don't have much planned for today. So today is kind of just a, a little more chill day. So I decided to get all my homework done today that I would be doing in Hawaii and to, to do my nails. 
and I do my nails at home. I have everything I need. I have like the whole like gel light thing and whatever. I like to do my nails at home. I'm thinking I'm gonna do something like this design, but the thing is instead of white, I am gonna do red because I love the red and I don't have white. Okay, as of right now, I have these on my fingernails because I'm currently wearing gel and soaking them with acetone with these clippies is the only way to get them off. I am still in my pajamas, like I said, today is a chill day. And I got some packages here that I wanna open up. Just some tools for me making videos, things that I think would be helpful when I'm in Hawaii, and also just overall helpful for me continuing my video journey. Let's open this small one first. I already know what it is. I mean, duh, I ordered it. So what I ordered was a card reader that I could plug into my phone. So instead of downloading all my digital camera pictures on my laptop first and then airdropping it or sending it to my phone, I can just plug this into my phone and put the SD card in and I get it right away. This is my other package. I. I'm super excited about this one. Open! Okay. Why was that packaging so hard to open? So I got this tripod specifically for my phone. I do have tons of tripods. By tons, I mean like, I mean like two. Here's a pretty long one if I extend it. Here's another tripod. I don't really travel with this one because this one is just a lot clunkier. This one I primarily use for my camera. My camera is on a tinier tripod. And so instead of switching my camera and my phone back and forth from that tripod, I bought my phone a second tripod. This tripod looks pretty helpful. And it's so sleek. Look how sleek this looks. Oh wow, look how tall. I'm 5'10 for reference. Jeez. I finished my nails and the left side, I think, looks absolutely immaculate. I kind of forgot about not painting the tip here and so I ended up just painting like little Mickeys on my ring finger. And then I just have tiny little Mickeys on each other. Hand. If you're right-handed and if you try painting your nails, your right hand ends up messed up because you're painting with your left, right? I spent so much time on my right hand for it to look like this. It's really disappointing. <laughs> I'm upset, but I was almost two and a half hours in and I was like, I'm so tired. But let's just take a look, see. It doesn't look that bad on camera, but compared to my left, And I made such a huge mess. Look like I have paint all over my legs. I had paint in my hair that I had to get off. You know, I'm happy that I got this done. I still think that they look pretty good for me doing them by myself. And now I'm gonna wash all of my tools and then do my homework. And then later on, I'm gonna grab dinner with Justin and next time you'll see me, I'll be packing. Hey guys, so a little bit of an update. It is currently 1.35 p.m. Obviously, it's dark in my room. I have not packed for Hawaii and we're leaving in six and a half hours to the airport. I am procrastinating packing like I always do, but I feel pretty ready even though nothing is in my suitcase. I have all my outfits planned out. I shared that on my TikTok. I shared some of it with you guys, or I already kind of have an idea what I'm wearing. So let's get packing.
like to welcome you to Buffalo.